What's up, world? It's your boy Double O coming at you live again from Atlanta, Georgia. Hope everybody's doing well. Hope you had a great week thus far, and uh, I hope that you are are, are really um, have written your goals down, and you develop your plan, and you are starting starting to move towards uh, um, realizing those goals. Uh, as you, many of you know, um, the Motown Hip Hop Tour is coming to a college near you. You know, we've opened it up from just being an HBCU tour to a college tour, and we're hoping uh, that uh, those of you who are out there have went to the website, check the website out, MotownHipHopTour.com. That's MotownHipHopTour.com. You see it right there at the bottom of the screen. Um, go to that website, um, sign up for our mailing list, uh, review the artists that we have there, review the blog. We've got some, some great blog posts that we've been putting up and hope that you will enjoy those and, and really uh, check them out and share those blog posts uh, with your friends and your family. Share the website with your friends and the family. If you're a business owner, we have sponsorship opportunities on the website. We'd, we'd be uh, very uh, uh, happy to partner with you and share some of some of what we're doing with you. And You know, you can market your, part, your, your products and your services too the next uh, generation of world uh, uh, shapers. Um, today, I just want to talk a little bit about uh, um, really uh, focusing on what you have to do on a daily basis um, uh, and maximizing your time um, because that's a really big part of getting over the hump. You know, it is finding ways to really maximize your time and getting things done that you need to get done, uh, spending time with, with your family and with your friends, and really building a life uh, that is happy and enjoyable. Um, you know, we really want to, to, to focus on, on achieving our goals, but you know, it's not something that happens overnight. And, and I keep, you know, I harp on that point a lot of times because I, I see a lot of people, they get discouraged and they get uh, um, despaired uh, about, uh, because it's not coming fast enough, it's not going fast enough, it's not, you're not achieving your goals as quickly as you want to. Well, you know, that happens for many reasons. Um, number one, it happens so you don't become overwhelmed with success. You know, success is something that can overwhelm you if it comes too quickly. Uh, if you haven't built a foundation that you can stand on that really uh, uh, has molded your character and, and you've developed yourself to handle that. Uh, many times you see people who, who, like somebody that wins the lottery, for example, um, there's a startling statistic out there that says, uh, I think it's like 97 to 98% of people who win the lottery are broke within the next couple of years. And that's startling. You know, uh, another, another statistic that, that you should look at is also like professional athletes. Uh, many of them uh, um, become millionaires instantly and once they graduate from college or they they're finished their they, they turn pro and then four years after they've quit playing uh, many of them are bankrupt or broke and that's very uh, uh, it's very sad and it's very uh, disparaging but what that what happens is and that's a lesson for all of us is that you know you have to build your foundation you have to surround yourself with good people uh, and then you have to understand that you know, you need to develop yourself, develop yourself uh, because you are, are the business. You are th the person that is, is really the business. Like uh, uh, one of my favorite rappers, Jay-Z said, I'm a businessman, not I'm a businessman, but I am a business man. And you are a business and you have to, to run your, your life that way so that you can really maximize your, your, your profits and your incomes and, and, and take yourself to the next level. Because it really is about what, who are you becoming and what are you becoming and, and, and the person that, that you want to be. Um, you know, I always say that uh, it only takes a, a, a one person to make the world a better place. And that person is you. Uh, you and I can make the world a better place instantly by becoming better people ourselves. So, so, you know, once you start to develop yourself and you start to become a better person, the world automatically becomes a better place. Same thing with your business. Once you start to become better, once you educate yourself, once you grasp those concepts, not to skim over them, grasp the concepts and understand the concepts, 
uh, uh, you become a better person and your business becomes better instantly. So that's something that I want you to really focus on and really think about is, you know, what, what can I do to make myself better today? Uh, and, and by making yourself better, you make your company better. You know, focus on, 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 on um, seven things that you can do today to make yourself better every day and then prioritize those things. So focus on, on what, what, what do I need to do today? I need seven items that I can accomplish. Strike them off my list every day. And then focus on those items. And, and you start with one and whatever that, that item is, you, you complete that item, then you move to the second, then you move to the third, then you move to the fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh in that order. Uh, anything that you don't finish, uh, uh, let's say today, you put it on the top of the list for tomorrow or you prioritize it with the things that you need to do tomorrow. And then watch it and, 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 and focus on that for 40 days. You know, break. You have to create that habit. And, and, and creating habits, you know, it takes anywhere from uh, 30 to 40 days to create a new habit and to banish an old habit. So, you know, you have to replace those bad habits with good habits. And the way you do that is constantly uh, 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 consistent action day to day to day. And, and you know, so start today, start, uh, uh, put your list together, seven things I need to do today, and let's make those seven things happen. And go down that list and don't go to the next thing until you complete the first one. Now, of course, you're going to get, you know, you, you'll get things thrown at you from, from all di different directions, but really, really focus on getting those seven things done. And then if something comes in, you know, if you have to shuffle your list around, prioritize it, put the put put the task on, on the list for tomorrow uh, to start that day. But make sure you, you work on getting seven things done every day uh, to complete your task, to make yourself a better person and to take your business to another level. Again, it really isn't about the business getting better. It's about you getting better. And every day that you get better, your business will get better. I guarantee it. So you, you will start to attract the right people. You will start to be in the right places. You know, uh, uh, um, really work on your attitude and, and, and work on being a, a friendly person, work on being uh, uh, communicating well and, and doing the things that you need to do to really, really, really uh, hone your skills, make yourself better and watch your business just blossom and grow. Uh, um, again, uh, join us for the Motown Hip Hop Tour, please. Uh, go visit our site, uh, MotownHipHopTour.com, uh, MotownHipHopTour.com. Uh, check us out, uh, review the artists, review the founders of, of the tour, uh, review the blog that we that we have up there. We got a lot of things going on on the blog I think you'll like. And just, you know, uh, browse the site and, and tell your friends and your family about it, you know, to go check us out and go visit us uh, on that on the blog. So it's MotownHipHopTour.com. We want to we want to visit your HBCU. So if you're an administrator or a student out there, please uh, uh, go to your SGA or suggest us to to your uh, your student activities uh, board so that we can visit your college or your university. Uh, we are opening up now to to uh, all colleges and universities. Uh, we definitely want to target HBCUs. Uh, um, being a graduate of an HBCU, I really want to visit those HBCUs, but. Again, we're opening it up to all colleges and universities. So if you go to a college or a university that needs uh, some entertainment, some good, clean entertainment, some, some entertainment that will really inspire them, uh, uh, the students there, inspire the staff, uh, please bring us to uh, the MotownHipHopTour.com. We're ready uh, to come to your school to entertain you, to make, uh, to make your uh, uh, um, spring semester enjoyable, to make your fall semester enjoyable. If you got a summer fest or anything like that going on, please look us up, go to the website, send me an email. We'll be glad to, uh, to chop it up with you and discuss how we can become a, a partner or how we can uh, um, really enhance uh, what you already have going on as well. Or you can come on and enhance what we have going on. So thanks again. I really appreciate you listening. Uh, uh, please visit the website. Check us out. Uh, again, write those seven things down. Look at me, I see a purpose within a bigger picture. When they look at me, they see a smoking, drinking alcohol. No future.
show where I'm from, you either rap or ball, and neither one is guaranteed, so when it all fails, it's back to the block, and the block gets you a small sale, a casket, you would think school is the destination, but my school is the them and get them done every day. Tomorrow I'll do the next list. Tomorrow I'll do the next list. But make sure you get all seven of those things struck off the list on a daily basis and you will grow and become a better person and your business will grow and your life will grow and you will enjoy it more. Thank you for listening. I really appreciate it. Peace. One love. The boat.